We do have many phone calls. We're going to try to get to as many as we can. Governor Deval Patrick is here. He awaits your calls. We're going to go right to calls. Uh, more calls right after this break. When news breaks, the choice is clear. WBZ News Radio 1030. Let's go back right to the phones. I'm sorry. Mike in Cambridge, uh, you've been very patient, my friend. I'm going to ask you to be as direct uh, and as uh, polite to the governor as you will be. Hey, Mike. Hi, Governor. Hi, How are uh, you? Dan Ray. Hi, I'm, Mike. Uh, I'm, I'm calling you know, about, actually, I just want to comment on Melissa's bill. I'm glad to yeah. see that uh, drug reform, the mandatory minimums, if, if this doesn't get passed, is included. Mm-hmm. I'm happy on that. And I, I'm asking about another thing I've been pushing and working on for a long time, another law, and it's medical marijuana. Mm. The ballot initiative, I want to know if, you know, Governor Patrick, if you would come out and support this, number one. It's mm-hmm. on the ballot this fall, right, Mike? I think it is, yeah, right? It is. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, it is. And whether or not, after the fact, whether you will, other governors in other states, Chris Christie has kind of blocked the New Jersey medical marijuana bill, and mm-hmm. I want to know if you will implement this once it is passed, because I'm pretty confident it's going to pass. Well, you have, you two, it, you have two questions You think there. it will, Mike? Yeah. Yeah. Mike? I, I'm sorry, you, what was that? You think it will pass? I, I absolutely do. Why do, you, why do you think it'll pass? It's polling at like seventy percent. Is it really? There's no, no, more, no issue more popular in the state. Really, and yeah, you know, just like decrim, it was sixty-five, thirty-five. I mean, that's a forty-point spread. Do you think it gets limited to medical uses, or do you think it's it's the start of something else? Um, I hope it's the start of something yeah. else. I'm a medical patient, but I, I, I feel like the, the medical, just having a medical, does make create a little bit of a problem. And yeah. I think it needs to be legalized completely across the board. Um, what yeah. you talk about the mandatory minimums, we turn kids into drug dealers. We're mm-hmm. trying to reduce drug use, but mm-hmm. the kids are the ones selling the drugs. Selling I the think box. it was I think it was uh, William F. Buckley Jr., a famous conservative, who said that uh, if you want to deal with the drug problem, um, take the profit out of it. And his point was legalize uh, legalize drugs. So I assume you would, I, you would endorse medical marijuana. No, I'm not endorsing it. I'm not expressing a point of view. Um, and I'm not dodging it. It's just I I got so much else I'm working okay, on. If it passes, will you enforce it? Well, I you know that's the that's I think what we're supposed to do. Good enough. All right, Mike. There's your answers. Thank All you right, much. Thank you guys. Thank, thank you, Mike. Soon. Good night. Let me go to Wayne and Brockton.